Checkmating your opponent with a king and rook is a fundamental endgame technique. Your goal is to drive the opponent's kin to the edge of the board. Okay, so in this opportunity, I'll show you the long way for you to do it. So you have multiple examples to understand the required principles to deliver this checkmate. Okay, so we're going to start uh, the combination with the move rook h3. Okay, the idea of this move is to force the king to go up thanks to the king's old position, right? This is the ideal position for you to make progress every time, okay? So that's what we're gonna try to do every time, okay? So after king f4, the best move in this position would be to play rook a3, okay? So the idea of rook a3 is to, create, is to have a waiting move and also put your rook into safety, okay? So after king g4, we continue to follow the king. What's very important about this technique is that it's got to be the black in the one that aligns with you and not the other way around, okay? So once the king is in front of you, you can get this check, right? And now you're making progress one more time, okay? So an important thing that you got to remember is the idea of the waiting move, right? Playing here, quick, I'm sorry, in this position, if you play king e3, you're making a mistake, right? Because after king a3, I'm sorry, after king e3, uh, you have a problem, right? Because now black skin is gonna move, right? And when the black skin is moving, right, you can't really give this check, right? Because if you do, the king is going to escape to the g4 square and you're not really making progress. Remember that our goal is to check make the king on this edge of the board, you see? So that's not gonna work if we lose the opposition, okay? So that's why the waiting move is so important and playing rook h4 would be the best thing for you to do right and then the king will run away right but remember once it's in front of you you can give the check right and now we're making progress one more time so remember the waiting move right you're not the one who is aligning with the king right it's black skin the one that has to be in front of you okay so there we go and there we go right so we get this check right and we continue with the same strategy right the waiting move very important to understand it okay and then when we we continue to follow the king and then when we get the opposition we give this check and now that we're at the back rank right uh we are ready to give this check make right and now one more time king's old position but remember the waiting move you're not the one who is aligning with the king and there you Ooh. go that's all she wrote okay i hope that helps thanks for watching